to fans that hands, this is Zuby Masters returning to my Let's Play a Final Fantasy VII Remake. Side of an hour, like I've got nothing better to do. I mean, look at all that steel work. You're trying to tell me that's not progress? <laughs> what the? You okay, buddy? <laughs> Mako junkie, huh? Figures. Shower can't come soon enough. I can barely tell my skin from all the ash and sweat. When I get back, it's refueling time. And you, Jesse? I don't know. Figure out how I screwed up? Huh. <laughs> You're such a kidder. the last time I saw a real one. Huh? <sighs> How sweet. When did you get so thoughtful? A guy can change. It has been five years. Huh? I need to talk to Barrett. Right. Come on in. Daddy, the Mako place blew up. Everyone on TV is talking about it. Don't you worry about all that silliness. Daddy's here and he's not going anywhere tonight. Now turn that thing off and let's get you to bed, huh? Do you mind keeping Marlene company until I'm done with this? Me? Yeah, you. Uh... think you're doing scaring my daughter like that daddy says never talk to strangers <laughs> that's right honey i do say that what a good girl you are remembering daddy's lessons <laughs> you know what else good girls do they go to bed on time come on but i'm not tired i want to talk some more daddy mm, all right but just this once <sighs> Uh, so then, what can I get you? My money. I'm still waiting on it. Uh, right. About that. We should talk outside. <sighs> um, Daddy? Do the people who died all return to the planet? Of course. Before we get on to money, there's an empty apartment in a place just down the road. It's nothing fancy, but I was thinking you could stay there for now. The landlady's a big friend of the cause, so you wouldn't even have to pay rent. Sound good? Sure does. Thanks. <laughs> Follow me then. How was it up on the plate? It was chaotic. Sorry for dragging you into all this. It was, it was wrong of me to put you in danger like that. 
I promise I won't do it again. Dangerous part of the job. Don't worry about me. Mm, I'll try not to. Always happy to help stick it to Shinra. Not good at all. So, you make nice with everyone? Not as I could, all things considered. Maybe not enough for them. Good. You had me worried. You're not exactly a people person. I'll give you that. I saw Sector 8 on the news. It was like a war zone. The news is just another Shinra mouthpiece. We'll spread whatever lies Shinra tells them to. So, it wasn't that bad? It was. Oh, right. And here we are. Good old Stargazer Heights. You're on the second floor. Room 201 here is where I sleep. Don't have time for much else, what with Seventh Heaven and all. <laughs> Not even time to decorate. Here's your room, 202. Don't worry, I already told the landlady about you. You did? Yes? Oh, I mean I told her I had a friend looking for a place to stay. Was that too much? No. It's fine. And this? That one's, uh... Know what? It's getting late. I'll introduce you tomorrow. It's a little bare, but should be enough to get you through the night. If you want anything else, we can always there get it. There is one thing. My money. You guys owe me 2,000, remember? I do. And we'd love to settle up, especially since this was your first job for us, but... That's it? Sorry. We spent the rest preparing for the mission. That really is it. But not for long. I'm collecting money for filters tomorrow, so I can pay you after. <sighs> and you're sure about that? Of course. As long as you help, that is. Wait. Then I'd have to pay you for that, too. Never mind. No, two thousand's enough. That's what we agreed on, so that'll be the price. With what you gave me, that leaves fifteen hundred. You're the best. I'll see you bright and early at the bar, then. Thanks again for everything. Sleep tight. It's time for introductions. Hey, you okay in there? Oh. Coming in.
Well now, you must be Cloud. I'm Marl, your landlady. So how'd you like the place? You from up on high? I've been around. I'll bet. No matter. All kinds come through with all kinds of reasons. If you ever need an ear to bend, I'll lend you mine. Can be about anything, even Tifa. What's she to you? The granddaughter I never had. And if you hurt her, I'll take it out of your hide. You hear me? Loud and clear. Good. Now you'd best get a move on to Seventh Heaven. She's got a head start on you and then some. Nothing to report. My husband decided to go. So many people who just don't get it. filters won't replace themselves although the next batch probably could if jesse put her mind to it most every home in the area has one folks love them because they practically eliminate the rotten egg smell honestly they make us more money than this place and it's easy money too we bring new filters collect the old ones and get paid what <sighs> give me a break i'm not a salesman i'm a soldier which is why no one will refuse to pay what do you say? Uh, Please? Uh, let's get this over with. Great. And while we're at it, I'll give you the grand tour. Go ahead and keep whatever we collect. Seeing as you didn't bring any luggage, I'm guessing there's stuff you need to buy. Thanks. And don't worry, we'll pay you the difference after. Barrett's out making his bands too. As long as I can get all to that. He'll take your money. Sounds like a pretty sweet gig. If you ever need someone to fill in, I'm your man. In your dreams, maybe. Huh? Cloud! Uh, since we're here, maybe we should do a little shopping. Suppose I could take a look. For anything else, drop on by. Especially if Teeth is with you. We'll see you around, okay? And let us know when your filter next needs changing. All the items you can want. He's a regular. Stock up here and he might throw in a freebie or two. For you, maybe. Well, you could try being a little nicer. To get free shit? Not my style. <laughs> Our next stop is Stargazer Heights. Landlady's a client. Just met her. Then you know what to expect. Remember, she's a good friend of Avalanche, so be nice. Please. Hmm? Just imagine if rich people start thinking it's safe down here. Apparently, it was done by a terrorist group called Cal. Nothing to report. Maintaining surveillance. Hey, Maro. Got some filters for ya. Tifa! My dear, dear girl! Oh, what's he doing here? Working? Be nice. <laughs> Cloud's helping me with collection. You better take care of her. I'm pretty good at taking care of myself, you know. That I do. Still, 
better him than you. No charm, no wit, big sword, but no skills. I've got skills. Be nice. I'm doing my best. You're looking awfully glum. Are you getting enough sleep? A good long rest of your... Are you... A tried and true lesson for life on the ground floor. Am I right? That you are. Now, your money. Thanks, Marl. You take care of yourself. Don't do it. No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. Come and check out our selection. Huh? I ain't got nothing for a punk-ass bitch like you. No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. Come and check out our selection. We gotta do something about the monsters on Twitter. Huh? Didn't know you were holding down the fort. Huh? Oh, uh, hey, Cloud. Looking to join the neighborhood watch? That depends. What does this neighborhood watch do? Uh, lots of stuff, really. But our top priority is taking care of any beasts that wander into town. That, and teaching the locals how to defend themselves. Like they say, the only one who will look out for you is you. Cloud's a great fighter, but only we know that. If no one knows him, no one will hire him. Thought if he joined the watch, he could get his name out there. That would work for everybody. Truth be told, we could really use your help. We can't pay you in kill, but we'll work something out. For example... Aha! What about your sword? I could mod it for you. No thanks. It's fine just the way it is. What? You some kind of purist? I know I'd never pass up a chance to improve my gear. Come on. At least let me show you how it's done. All set. 
Needless to say, you'll have to try it out to appreciate the difference. Thanks. <laughs> we'll do you one better. Spread the word to everyone who'll listen about the new Mercantown. Between him and Wedge, there isn't anyone they don't know. I'll march through the streets singing your praises, even on an empty stomach. So, where are these monsters? Scrap Boulevard. Good hunting. Hey, Cloud, I'll come with. No, I've got this. But you don't know the way, do you? We don't. <laughs> sure thing. I know these streets better than anyone. Boulevard is out west. Past the barricades, He's supposed to keep the monsters out. Anyway, we should prepare just in case. I'm searching for candidates. Good luck, Tifa, and be careful. Here's Scrap Boulevard. I can see why monsters appear right at home. And the more we pile up, the more they show up. Show me what you got, Cal. Wow, so that's what a soldier looks like in action. This was just a warm up. <laughs> I'll bet. Let's keep at it. in like it was nothing you too it's a little surprising well i've been here five years now if you don't look out for yourself no one else will by the way that was a test. this a lesson gotta learn if you're gonna stick around okay let's wrap this up All right, I think that might be the last of them. They won't stay gone for long. Of course not. Even so, folks will be grateful for the peace and quiet in the meantime. A win's a win, you know? True. Trust me, it'll do wonders for your rep. Right, let's go check in with Biggs and Wedge. Searching for candidates. I hear you so. Back already? Got every last one too. Now the slum should be safe. You guys are machines. Good job. Meanwhile, we told everyone we could about you. So I heard. 
I've got to ask, though. What did you tell them? It's all right. All you got to do is keep up the good work. It'll pay off soon enough, I promise. How's the sword, by the way? Good. Glad to hear it. Seems like the perfect fit for you. Yeah. We've been through a lot. Oh. You okay? I'm fine. Been meaning to ask. After you left the village... It's a long story. I've got time. Why don't you tell me all about it while we try to wrestle up some more work for you? That sounds great! I'll come too! Oh, uh, no you won't. What? Not long now, you two. Sorry, Go on. maybe uh. next time. Huh? No fair! Uh. Think about it for a second. They haven't seen each other in years. You'd be a third wheel. Uh. <sighs> hey, before we get back to it, why don't you check out the weapons? No need. Come on, the dealer's probably heard all about you by now. Might treat you better. I don't know about that. You hear someone got rid of all the monsters on the You know, there's a hole in the break room roof. Pete, you just opened up shop and Searching for candidates. Oh, hey there, Tifa. You need a helping hand? Actually, I wanted to introduce you to an old friend of mine. This is Cloud. He's a merc. Ah, you don't say. Well, we're always on the lookout for experienced fighters to help us deal with the bigger critters. I'll take on anything. For the right price, that is. Experienced and cocky, huh? If it's a challenge you want, I might have a few good ones. Your clients can fill you in on the detail. Prove yourself at these jobs, and I'll see if I can't find you some more. Thanks. 
Candidate detected. Performing physical analysis. Sizable weapon. Excellent cardiovascular health and impressive lung capacity. Perfectly balanced muscle and bone structure. An optimal candidate. My name is Chadley. I'm an intern for Shinra's Research and Development Division. I hope you'll be interested in helping me with my research. Please accept this as a down payment. I would like you to set that assessed materia in your equipment and use it to gather intelligence in battle. This data will help me to develop new types of materia. I'm not interested in working for Shinra. You should know that I work actively to undermine Shinra's efforts. I'm sure you of all people can appreciate the tremendous power of materia as well as how it might be wielded against your corporate enemies. And if you later decide that I am not worthy of your trust, you can do what you do best. I will hold you to that. Excellent! Then we shall work together so long as you deem fit. Once you've completed your task, please return and report to me. Bad. Won't be tough. to gather the data I requested. Here is the rest of your payment. I have developed new materia. Would you like to see it? I plan to develop... I'll keep preparing more battle intel reports, which I hope you will assist me in completing. Sure. Was all right, I guess. Think of each job as an opportunity. Not to make money, but to build connections. It's not what you know, but who. <laughs> you remembered. Not a patient teacher. <laughs> Maybe not so patient next time. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, Barrett should have finished collecting his share of the money by now. So what do you want to do? Head back to the bar? Hey there, Tifa. Welcome back. And you, the new mercantile looking for work, right? Yeah. In that case, maybe you could do something about the Doom Rats? Them and their were rat buddies have been tearing up town looking for food and whatnot. Got into the store and made one hell of a mess, let me tell you. <laughs> oh, you think that's funny, do you? Don't lie. I saw you crack a smile. Well, do the job and you can laugh it up for all I care. Anyway, they're probably nesting in the outskirts. Now I've heard a were rat in pain will call its friends for help. And the whole rat pack will come running just like that.
our go-to monsters. Urge a cleaned up scrap boulevard. Piece of cake. Worked up a good sweat. See what he's gonna do. Heard you cleaned up Scrap Boulevard. Thank you, The watch is saying you're Was think I might chat up on him. So they blew up a reactor. My husband decided to go. Aha, the man with the straight head is so bad. My husband knows it. A friend of mine, an inspiring actor. Seen doom rats around. Hmm. What do you think? Should we wait? You know, this might be a waste of time. Let's head back to the store and touch base for now. Some wear racks, which is nice and all, but the job was to wipe out the doom rats. 
No biggie. Get back out there and finish the job, and we're good. Don't look so glum. It's only a matter of time until they show up. You'll get them back. All the items you can want. Another A friend of mine's an aspiring mm -hmm. actor. No turning back. Finally managed to get those doom rats, huh? Thanks, guys. You're the greatest. It was so dead in here, I thought I might have to close up shop for good. Hey, got an idea. Hear me out. If the guy who took care of the town's rat problem told everybody where he liked to shop, well, what do you say? I'll make it worth your while, of course. Give you some incentive. Talk you up to Weimer and my customers and anybody else who listen. You'll be swimming in work before you know it. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Seventh Heaven, the new Merc in town in my little store. I can see it now. We're gonna clean up. Well, that's it for this video. Hope you like it and stay tuned.